Hi, I'm Sherry Anderson with Remax First Advantage, and today we're with the owner of Harper's Tavern, Joey Straw. Joey, how long have you owned this business? In July, it'll be 17 years. So we know there's a lot of historic value here. How did you get into the restaurant business? I always worked in restaurants all my life, and I just thought it would be nice to own my own place. So. This was a perfect place to buy. And the atmosphere is so quaint. Um, I know you have a room you call the library where people like to dine. Mm -hmm. You have outdoor dining as well. Yes. You have a fabulous bar which is behind us. And what are some of your favorite special foods that you prepare here? Uh, we serve a lot of uh, my crab cakes, uh, prime rib, peanut butter pie which I make, and uh, Carl's crab scampi. Just a lot of homemade really good food that we serve here. Great, and I know you have a lot of locals that continue to bring family, friends, probably have all kinds of private parties. Um, what else can you tell us about your restaurant? Uh, we also have a dining room upstairs that seats 50 people, so we do a lot of birthday parties, retirement parties, rehearsal dinners up there. Uh, what are your hours? So for now, because of COVID, we're open Tuesday through Saturday, 2 to 9 p.m. Great. Okay. And I know we had the opportunity to meet with one of your chefs in the kitchen, and we're going to be sharing some food um, that he had prepared. I know my family was here most recently for celebrating a birthday, and we had a great meal. Everyone loves to come here. So Harper's Tavern has been here since 1804, over 200 years. And I guess, Joey, my question is, is, has it always been called Harper's Tavern, or has the name changed over those 200 years? Nope, it's always been uh, Harper's Tavern for 217 years. Amazing. So why would it not be considered a restaurant in a tavern? Is there a meaning to a tavern? Um, 200 years ago, they would build taverns every 10 miles for people with their horse and carriage to stop and rest, warm up, and have a drink. So that's interesting. So I can't imagine so, driving in my horse and buggy and I would be thrilled to find a restaurant or tavern they called it back then. Every 10 miles there was a tavern. <laughs> interesting. So um, when you purchased this, um, was the bar the way it is now? Because it's gorgeous. I mean, it has solid wood, it has the, the grass. Mm -hmm. Have you made any modifications? I made it a little longer after the flood in 2011. Uh, tropical Storm Lee, we had a little bit of flood damage, but other than that, it's the same. That's the original bar. Wow, it's beautiful. And is there a special drink that you make here that's new? Yes, we do a Harptini. It's our signature drink. And what's in the Harptini? So it's Malibu rum, coconut rum, uh, melon liqueur, pineapple juice, and sour mix. Ooh, it sounds very refreshing. We sell a lot of it. We had a great time meeting with Joey today and finding out all about Harper's Tavern. As local business owners ourselves, as realtors with Remax First Advantage, we know how important it is to support these local businesses. That's why we teamed up with Explore My Town so we can feature your local business in the near future. Drop us a message below or feel free to give us a call so we can set up a time to meet with you. This site will continue to grow and expand as we all support local together. I said